egg spot. For this project, we'll need a small Phillips head screwdriver and a flat head screwdriver. Always begin by removing the battery and AC adapter. Remove the two screws right below the battery that hold down the center control media button cover. Flip the laptop over, open the laptop screen as wide as possible. Carefully lift the center control media button cover away from the base. Be careful lifting the cover up, the media cable is still attached to the motherboard. Unscrew the two screws holding the keyboard to the base assembly. Remove the keyboard trim plastic. Start by lifting the plastic at the top of the corner, working your way around the keyboard. Be very careful while lifting the keyboard up because the cable is connected to the motherboard and can break the latch. Carefully lift the cable latch and unhook the cable removing the keyboard. Install the keyboard cable into the connector and press down on the latch. Lay the keyboard into the base and secure it with the two screws. Replace the keyboard trim plastic. Snap the media button cover to the base. Close and flip the laptop over. Replace the two screws that hold the power button cover to the laptop base assembly. Reseat the battery. I hope you found this tutorial useful. All parts discussed in this tutorial can be found at partspeople.com.